Hang on a second. I need to vlog. Let's do this if we're gonna do it. Classy, bougie, rich. <laughs> Look at my toes. You know I never put the pressure on you. You knew what it was when you signed up. <laughs> It's all of destiny. Let's start this weekly vlog off on Wednesday, May the 6th. We gotta take it back, take it back, back, back. So on this particular day, it was a filming day. On filming days, I don't do too much vlogging outside of that, but I filmed a full wash day routine on my natural hair using the Cream of Nature Pure Honey line. If you all want to check that out, I'll link it for you all down below. Thursday was also a filming day, but I did get a small amount of vlog footage for you all. And of course, before we film, we have to fluff the hair. What's today? Thursday, May the 7th. I just finished filming a Amazon unboxing and haul. I'm about to clean everything up now. Normally I make kind of a mess. By the time y'all see this, the video will be out. I'm about to clean everything up now and trash it. Finally get to use my products. Life of a YouTuber, we be waiting to open stuff and film it and all of that. I filmed in the living room because I wanted a different kind of setup, if you will. But I'm about to get my day started. I just wanted to check in with you guys. What did my Friday consist of? I don't even remember. Moving along to Saturday, I got a new plant. I went to Walmart. I'm gonna haul a few things for you all. And I don't know what I'm gonna name her yet. If you follow me on Twitter, you know that I wanted a plant for the film room. I was trying to decide fake or real. I take good care of this other plant that I have. So for like two years now, so I was like, you know, get you a live plant, sis. She's gonna get up to five feet tall. So stay tuned for that. I also got some take-alongs, either for when we're at our parents' house and we want to bring home leftovers, or when we have leftovers that we need to store away. And then I got these cute clear glass bowls. I love eating my cereal in these. Like, picture some Fruit Loops just floating in this bowl. Yes, sir. <laughs> Take a picture of my cup. Take a picture. Okay, let's show them your car. My nephew wants you all to see this. Okay. Tell them about your car. They're listening. They want to know. It's a BMW in the back seat. Does it go fast? Yeah. Break the traffic. They're going to see your tag number. Oh, no. Look how he put his hand. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. You're going to get your scooter? What's under there? And we also got this full-length mirror installed at the end of our hallway. It's from Walmart as well. And, yeah, a lot of y'all were DMing me like, where's that mirror from? When I put it on my Instagram story. So, now y'all know. It's from Walmart. That's what it looks like. Forgot to show you all, like, the finished look of it at the end of the haul. So, I'll do that in another vlog. This shelf, by the way, is from Lowe's. Uh, we're going to put this in the film room. I'll link everything that's linkable down below if I didn't say that already. Okay, so quick little glimpse at the before. This is the corner that I kind of don't show that much when I'm filming just because it was ugly, but somebody remind me also that bag is full of shoes that I need to put on Poshmark. Like, <laughs> so since it was already pretty late while we were working on this, I decided to just go ahead and move a few little things just to decorate the shelf with just to get it started a bit uh we did tackle a lot of other things off camera so this was all i wanted to finish for the night there's always tomorrow okay i lied actually we're gonna skip ahead a full week june 3rd my sister's birthday i opened my instagram to get ready to post a picture of my sister because today is her birthday and there we go get that iso rice and i get on to instagram and look who's all in my comment section there's the chick it's really them <laughs> Nah, I was the one that wasn't sure. I'm like, is this them? Love get ready with me in live chats. This is a Instagram, little short Instagram TV video that I did. Oh, I'm not even in the frame. And they liked that. They also commented on this photo of me where I used their makeup. I think someone asked me what foundation I probably had on. So that's probably how they ended up getting tagged in this, maybe. I don't know. They liked a lot of my photos. Lots of them starting with this one oh, and then i just kept going and going and going I asked Monique, i said i wonder if a pr email is going to follow this oh with the iso we got to fix it now and turn on some lights either way i'm just joking but i also forgot to tell you all because i haven't been um vlogging i also got an email and it's so ironic because a lot of you all are telling me different natural products to try next and one morning i'll put the screenshot up if i can find it but i got a dm from camille rose naturals saying that they love my work i'm both here on youtube as well as instagram Instagram. They were updating their PR list for 2020 and they basically wanted me to sign up to be a part of receiving PR from Camille Rose Naturals and I was just really happy.
happy about that. I just wanted to tell you all because I was happy about it. Yeah, just a small little update on it. Well, I wouldn't even say small. Why do we have to diminish things? To me, it's a big deal. So I want to publicly say that it's a big deal, that I'm happy about both of those things that have happened recently. So yes. And today is my sister's birthday, by the way. <laughs> I'm just grabbing the camera to show you all that. Depending on how many likes you get in a day on something, it'll get pushed to the bottom. And I'm just glad that I noticed that before posting a picture because I wouldn't have even seen it. I would have missed it because Instagram only shows you a certain amount of notifications. But anyways, I'm running my mouth a lot. This battery's blinking anyways. Okay, I just realized why I'm being tagged by, well not being tagged by Melanie. You guys are tagging me. Melanie asked people to tag your favorite black artists and creators below. For everyone that watches my makeup tutorials y'all know i love the milani foundation and in my like drugstore video that's the foundation that i use and that's what i'm currently wearing this isn't sponsored anything i'm just like showing what's going on currently shout out to queen gonzalez 5 she tagged me on milani's post where they ask people to you know tag people <laughs> out for the on screen y'all should be seeing it right now let me stand to this side so i can post it so yeah i guess they're checking out the actual sorry i had to swap out my battery died but yeah that's like super cool like thank you so so much queen underscore gonzalez five here go what milani was like in my photos <laughs> this girl no, tagged me on my instagram i've been getting tagged in a lot of the tag of black influencer posts that's been circulating youtube like if y'all watch my stories then y'all probably been seeing them where y'all be like tagging me and i'll be reposting y'all it means a lot to even consider you for that tim say happy birthday to dominique by the way it's too much brightness to let me not take over he play some, but tell him I just did that hand thing he be doing. Oh, look at his glasses. Why, why is the other side apart? to your glasses, sir? He holding his glasses up like this behind the ear size. Oh, it's broken. You know, when you text him and you try to find the right thing to say, you're like, Grace said this, so what should I say next? They said we love Get Ready With Me's in live chats. And I love Milani <laughs> when using Milani in my live chat. <laughs> nah, okay, let me keep it simple, sis. All right, y'all, I'm finna go, cause the Oval is on. Wednesdays at eight, I watch The Oval on BET. Maxi dress, by the way. If you're wondering, I put a picture that I took in it today. Look at my plant, she's just growing back there. We need a name for her. I would say she, cause she's very much a woman. Classy, bougie, ratchet. <laughs> oh yeah, if you all like my beat, like the face that you see, it's our drugstore. So I just wanna let you know, it's the same face from the video that's already on my channel. Ratchet Destiny says, hey, whenever you see a whole bunch of this and a whole bunch of this and that and ah ah, bop bop, woo woo, all that going on, that's her. This, this her, all this, that be her. Cause all of Destiny very much gives you, she stand still when she talk. But look, look, there you go again, this right here, Ratchet. But if you saw my drugstore makeup video, then you heard me say also that I'm very much letting her live lately. Hello, Destiny. Hello, Ratchet Destiny. Hey, y'all, it's all of Destiny, and today I'm about to go. <laughs> so, peace. <laughs> I'll talk to you all next time I pick this up again. Skipping ahead about three more days because who can force themselves to vlog daily? Today, we're going to be tackling the film room. Need to do a bit more cleaning in here and then just some laundry. This is a quick before if you've ever wondered what the rest of this room looks like outside of what you all see when I film videos sitting at that vanity. Do you like my outfit? Yep, it looks really nice. Should take an Instagram it's picture. My first time wearing my shoes. That's nice. Should I put the little thing clips in? Yeah, uh, yeah, you could. Hold on, what's the little thing? White, <laughs> white. <laughs> oh, cool. Oops, I just knocked something all the way back there. Just great. Can we talk about something that I really miss, like really miss? The Lysol disinfectant wipes, like it's the small things that we don't really appreciate until they're gone. So any of my nail polishes that won't fit on the nail polish rack, I normally just sit them over here in the window. You don't really wanna get sun exposure to your polishes too much, but they usually work fine. Don't do what I do. <laughs> Put yours somewhere else. 
Okay, let's go ahead and talk about the nail polish rack because I get lots of questions about that. I actually built it myself a couple of years ago. I didn't film it, didn't think anyone would care. When we moved from my parents' house to here, actually just took it down and brought it with us. So it's very durable. I like it a lot. I also get a lot of comments suggesting that we should paint it, but we've never painted it because we just never really had the desire to want to. Oh, so the new polishes that you see me putting on there are from Nail Addict. A lot of my videos got pushed back since I kind of put a pause in my content. Some of y'all were asking me like, where you been? It's been two weeks. Uh, where your uploads at? I kind of just thought that was kind of self-explanatory that, you know, more important matters are going on. So I was like, I don't have to post a YouTube video right now. Uh, I was protesting and doing different things like that, so YouTube was just like on the back end. The collapsible bins are from Walmart, by the way, but as far as all of that, like I said, I got a video coming with the nail attic. I need to review their polishes, a lot of other stuff that I pushed back. The vlog camera is still broken, but so are a lot of other things going on in life right now but either way still making do I just didn't really care to get it fixed because I'm just going to continue using the DSLR until it's an absolute must that I need to get it fixed hair products are going in one bin and then anything film related is going in the other bin and the rest of this is self-explanatory so enjoy the music You know I never put the pressure on you. You knew what it was when you signed up. I guess I could do a little bit of chatting in this vlog. Now we're in the restroom. I'm gonna show you. I forgot to do like an overlay to show you all so far where we are in the film room with me just kind of cleaning up. I won't lie, for the past couple of days, I've been doing nothing with my life, waking up, getting breakfast, showering, getting dressed, watching The Walking Dead, taking a break only to go to the restroom, grab something to eat, quick errand run. Y'all ask me about different shows, like, hey, Destiny, are you watching this show or that show? For me, TV and all of that is extracurricular. And I know me, when I get on a show or even on Netflix, when it's got a whole bunch of seasons, I'll binge. They start with a, conf a conflict, resolve the conflict, and then they bring up something else at the end, and it ends, you have to wait until next week. Difference with Netflix, currently what I'm talking about, but by the way, it's The Walking Dead. Everybody else has probably already been on that. I'm new to being on it. I know my sister used to always watch it. She's like, I'm watching Walking Dead, and I'll just blow it off. Line. But I'm watching it now, so every time it gets to the end, why are you punching like this? Every time it gets to the end, I'm just like, all the seasons are right there, so I don't have to wait until next week. Kind of like the Oval on BET. That's the only thing I'm currently watching on TV besides Netflix. I was like, today, I'm like, do not wake up and cut the TV on. I do need to get some things done. So that's what we're doing today, basically. When I sit down, I want to keep going until maybe three o'clock it's 1 39 right now I did a pedicure so that's one thing I can check off we starting on the film room that's another thing I could check off because Dominique was like you need to get in there and clean up that mess you've made I know what sounds y'all be like never mind I won't even give that this that disclaimer because I was destroying the film room and Dominique was like hey you're filming there because you ruined it it's like I really did <laughs> like all the junk in there it's my mess that I made. Y'all done see none of Dominique's stuff out of place because, you know, she keep her things clean. But that's neither here or there. So I wash that film room rug on Delicate all the time. It never ruins it. And it gets a nice clean and white. So it's once a month to get it clean. But right here where I pull the shower curtain back at each time, I guess after I wash my makeup off, I think I washed my hands well enough, but probably didn't. And this is where I touch and slide it back. Like the rest of everything else is still perfectly white, except for this area. So I'm gonna put the two in there together. But the rug air dries well. Knowing me, I probably got the overlay of me taking this down on top of me talking. It is a heck, it makes the video shorter. If I didn't, then cue the music. I could take the rod down, but uh, you could also just take down what you need. Okay, I'm talking back to you now. Oh, you know what? I should go ahead and wash this too while I'm taking it down. I should have snatched both of these down while I was at it. Let's just get started cleaning. You just keep going and going until you stop. I like that though. You know how day to day you'll just straighten up? When I do deep cleaning, I'll be like, may as well get it over with. Let's do this if we're gonna do it. 
This is gonna make me wash everything now. Okay, let's go to the laundry room. I have to review these clothes from Shein, but I need to also wash all of those first. I got anxious, I was taking them out looking at them. Okay, let's go in here. Look at my toes, white toes are back. I didn't film it because I didn't want to flood with another white pedicure tutorial again. I got the rug, the rug, the rug. Y'all probably can't see it in person depending on the white balance on my camera. It's still going to make white look white because that's what these things do. And when I edit most times, I auto-correct my white balance because it gives it a better look. I kind of when we like stand on this stuff. So I'm just going to throw both of these in there. Oh, you can see it now. Yeah, you can see it compared to the washer. You can see it. I'm gonna go to delicate, regular. I wonder what happened if I did casual. Nah, we'll keep it where I always keep it. Popping like a rubber band, yeah. And we just having fun, girl. I can't be your man. And that's the time live. Money and pretty women. Hang on a second. I need to vlog. So, guys, I am about to have Chipotle. Just in case I need this. Maybe. My thumbnails be so trash, I know. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> what I do, what I do, I... Okay, anyway, never had Chipotle before. So the one that I have, I don't eat out that much. I, I won't say that, but you know how you have your restaurants of choice? I just never had Chipotle, so. Made a Chipotle run. The order was placed online and I just went in and got it, so. Yeah. Come on, don't do that to me. Thank you. Sofritas bowl with brown rice, black beans, sofritas, mild tomato, medium corn, and lettuce. And then, let's go back out, Destiny. Got some chips in there. Shout out to my brother for this. I feel like I should warm it a bit. Ooh, it looks really good. <laughs> I'm about to eat this to watch The Walking Dead. Honestly, I'm probably gonna be here for the rest of the day. So the camera, there's no need in letting it sit right there while I sit right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and conclude for today to this water and the Sprite. I'm on The Walking Dead season five, episode two. Everybody else probably already seen Walking Dead. I'm late. I think I already said that in the bathroom scene. Never mind. I like my hair. It's doing its thing and I let it do its thing. Let's get a fork and try this. I should put my Galaxy Buds in, huh? You used to knowing when I'm done vlogging, I guess so, right? Hold on. In the last vlog, one of y'all had wanted me to like pray aloud, but I don't know why I don't. I just. Wow. This is yummy. I'm gonna warm this in the microwave for like 30 seconds. I'll talk to y'all later. Whenever I put the camera back on again. I'm about to put on this face mask. I need to get some more of this type. Like I only have sheet masks. I prefer masks like this over sheet masks. You can move around more with another mask on over a sheet mask. Before I put that one on, I'm gonna check and see. Make sure I don't have a different type. I do have another one, but it's a peel off mask and I don't really wanna do a peel off cause it might hurt. <laughs> know what, let's do it. I've never used it before. It's a skin hydrating peel mask. I already cleansed my face, let me make sure. A mild tingling sensation is normal upon application of this mask. Tingling why? Tingling why? I always tie this up so high on me. <laughs> Apply to fresh, clean face, dry skin. Leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then peel off starting at the jawline upward. Ooh, I don't know if I want to do peel off. I feel like they hurt more so because of the peach fuzz on the face than anything else. Let's not do that. This is a bubble paper man, but it's still a paper man. Let me see. What else we got in here? Maybe this. If y'all are curious about this, we did this in another video. By the way, if y'all wanna check that out. Ooh, I need to do another spa day because I need to use a lot of this stuff. A lot of y'all sent me this if y'all like, where is it from? Energizing coffee mask. This way, wait, wait, this one. Powder to clay. This is a wash off mask. Hmm. I'm trying to decide which mask I want to put on. I wanted to put it on, then get in the shower. And by the time I'm done with the shower, just rinse it off in there and take this off. I grabbed the camera, honestly, at the last minute because I was just about to do all of this. But I'm trying to get back in the swing of things with vlogging. 
I'm gonna take my shower and then I'll think about it while I'm in there. We'll be back. And my shower was amazing. I didn't do the face mask yet. Y'all see what the shower do? Like, I take my bonnet off when I shower. The steam could just do something to my hair. I don't know. I don't know. Mm. This is the same one I used in my maintenance routine. I didn't expect that video to do as well as it did. Like, I think it said a million views now in three months. Well, four now, actually. You could tell I didn't put lotion on yet either. Oh, well, whatever. Oh my goodness. Oh God. I haven't done this in like two months. Tell me we got something. Tell me it came with a chopper. Boom, kidding. Oh, we got something. Skip ahead if you don't want to see this part. I'm about to show it for those that like it. Oddly satisfying. I'm just about to rinse my face off again, buy some moisturizer, try to do something to my <sighs> hair. <laughs> it looked crazy. <sighs> I wipe with witch hazel, Thayer's witch hazel, instead of wiping with alcohol just so it wouldn't sting my nose. And now I'm just applying this moisturizer. It came in like a little uh, kit that one of my subscribers sent me. It had a lot of little sample sized products in it. This is Bliss Drench and Quench. Quince, drench and quince. Cream to water, hydrated for all day moisture. I like to spread my products out so that I don't always have to go to my restroom when I need something. So I keep some moisturizers in here, some in the restroom. Whenever I'm in here, I just reach for that one. I do have like a detailed skincare routine on my channel. If y'all are curious in that, I'll link it down below. It's fairly new, nothing's changed. Now, I could wax these out, but I'm just going to tweeze them out. See that? We really up close. We giving you what Bone be saying. My sister Bone, she loves the quality of this camera. But when you zoom in, girl, mm, catch me in person because the camera, it just shows everything. But either way, it's hard to do this on camera. I like to just grab them with a tweezer instead of waxing it or shaving it just because I can get it right at the root. Or not. Oof. Oof. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have to get in real close and check. I don't want none of that showing when I put on my makeup or just period, period. I need to show you all this room too before I forget. Me prolonging showing it means, you know, keep it clean, Destiny, because you didn't show it yet. You're gonna have to clean it up again just to give them the finished look. But I do have like a room tour on this room. Changed a bit, of, a few things since the room tour. Why is the camera on? What are you talking about, Destiny? All right, when I come back, I think I should have something cute done to my hair. I don't really feel like filming the detail. Like, watch me do my hair what to do to it it's kind of damp so maybe water and oil will just reactivate the products i don't know how to do my natural hair that well rewind that screen record it whatever you would like yep i said it <laughs> but don't get me wrong like if you really think about it i think the last i wore a wig was in february the last i remember wearing one was valentine's day february like my natural hair aside from me doing braids feet and braids when i do those on myself my natural hair has been out <laughs> don't get it twisted why are we so close baby like don't get it twisted i wish i could go to the side i'll be back don't rush little touch mm -mm -mm. what they be doing hold on i think it's a new one out now wipe wipe let's show y'all my full outfit this shirt is from shein it's a medium it's yesterday scratched out and then it says now and then it says tomorrow scratched out this shirt for me is it's kind of ironic because <laughs> i'm such a procrastinator i'm such a well i do today what you can do tomorrow type of person but i like this shirt i love the color of this shirt the jeans are also from shein when i did my last clothing haul with them so i just threw these back on not because they're from shein but one of the only few pairs of black pants that i got this side has a little cut right here too really high waisted so you could tuck here if i wanted to like that let's see if i can sit it down to really give y'all the mm, the ooh la la this is how you give angles on instagram see this is how you give them might take a picture today we got the white toes back i don't know if y'all noticed that they back it's lit because the light on here there we go it's picking up different color on camera, but I like how it come down. Like, it's not standard t-shirt length. Like, it come down longer than that. I like that a lot. Oh, I like it. I like it. Oh, now we got too much brightness since I'm close up. Oh, I like it. I like it. Oh, I like it. I like it. Oh, I look so cute. I haven't done my makeup in a good little minute. A good little minute. I didn't rewash my hair, but my curls are popping. 
I have to show you all my routine soon. My hair, I always like my curls. After I wash my hair and I style my hair and I sleep on my hair for like two days when it's time for me to refresh the curls. Child, I'll show y'all my curl refreshing method next time I do my hair, the day that I need to refresh them. That's when I like my hair the best. It's still dry, so I try not to touch it too much and all the fluffing and stuff that people suggest you do. I'm not messing with my hair until it dries and I just kind of lift like a not defined center part just to see how I like it because I always wear my hair on the left. I kind of cut my hair and when I look at it, I didn't really cut it for evenness or anything like that. I just cut pieces that I saw that weren't defined as far as the curls go. But now I kind of regret doing that. If you kind of decide to start cutting at your hair without defining the curls, you'll cut off pieces that just weren't properly defined and mistake for assuming heat damage. When I don't even use heat on my hair, so I, I never assume that anyway. I mean, people come in <laughs> and say, you know, whatever they would like. I didn't have heat damage. Didn't properly define my curls, but that's neither here or there. I like the shape on this side. Like, y'all see how this side is like, as it dries, it just gets shorter and shorter, which is fine with me. I don't really care about that part. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Like, I need to take pictures. I was debating posting some of the photos for my 250k like photo shoot that I had done. But the timing ended up not being right. I didn't want to like post about giveaway stuff. Also, if y'all are wondering too, like Destiny just skipping over it, I'm not. We did reach 250,000 subscribers. I got to get the giveaway stuff together. I was gonna go back and read through the comments from you guys to see what y'all want the giveaway to be. With everything that was going on, I didn't get around to posting the photos kind of didn't want to post the photos because i didn't want to be like oh 250k <laughs> meanwhile we had blackout tuesday and all of that going on so i was like yeah the timing is not right for this but if y'all were wondering because i know people still come to youtube for escape purposes and all of that so i'm definitely still doing the 250k giveaway i just wanted to kind of push that back a while it wasn't really as important to be like hey so what do y'all want for giveaway? what y'all know yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm still holding those photos. I don't know, probably by the time y'all see this, they may be on my Instagram. So we'll see. I've been kind of on Instagram, or I just say social media, period. I've kind of been on it, but then I also just kind of take little mental break checkouts. When you come back to social media, do you go and catch up on everything you missed? Or is it just like, you know, I'll see what I see when I see it? I hate the pressure of, oh, let me hurry up and watch people's stories because they disappear in 24 hours. <sighs> Social media is just a whole nother conversation and chat within itself. This is very impromptu. I was supposed to be here to finish filming this little portion of this right here. And my brushes are clean too. I don't know if y'all noticed that because I wash them. And I don't use all of them every time I do my face. But everything that I'm saying is just me rambling on and on and on. But I haven't talked to y'all in a while. So I can imagine the comments saying, oh, it's fine. We love it. I like this color on me. I like this color on me. And I like yellow on me. I'm about to go back and sit on the couch and watch The Walking Dead and do nothing for the rest of the day. So if this is all for today, I'll talk to y'all whenever I cut the camera back on. And if you do like my makeup, by the way, my last makeup tutorial, this is that. The way I do my makeup, I never really switch it up. So yeah, this is that look. Probably just a different thing on my lips. This is one of the fancy glosses. And hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. And this clip is five minutes, so bye. I'll talk to y'all later. So I completely forgot. These been sitting here. So we got these a good couple of days ago. If you're new to my channel, I don't shop at Bath and Body Works unless they have a sale. I don't care. I have to have a coupon. I have to have a sale. Oh my God, it smells so good. But they had $10 off candles that are normally $25. What, $14 instead? Oh no, I got each one for 11 bucks. I forgot I had a 20% off. Hey! <laughs> want to take a picture, please? You want to take a picture? Okay. Okay, come get in. We'll take a picture. Come hey, guys, it's a definitely. Come and get in. Careful, don't hurt yourself on the box. It's a day. Okay, say cheese. One, two. You got to look right there. You got to look right there. Say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> Five different candles. I got Flamingo Beach. I'll just take them out and tell y'all exactly what they are. This is nothing that should be stretched out beyond two minute clip. This is Passion Fruit Vanilla Cupcake. Obviously, since I ordered these online, I just went off of the notes. I didn't really make a post to X y'all or anything this time. Actually, we went live together on Instagram. That's what we did. You can tell it's been a while. The package came pretty quick for what shipping is. Obviously, sometimes people be like, did it come in three hours after you ordered it? And it's just like, be realistic, y'all. Oh, this one smells just like that one. Oh. This is a strawberry pound cake. I you got a pot pot? No. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. When I got the wildflowers, y'all recommended strawberry pound cake. 
when I say I love that wildflower, so I was like, let me get the matching candle because it's still plugged up in my room. It hasn't ran out yet. Oh, well, it's a well, no, no, you see, know it. It's a no, no, you know it. That's what I love to say to him. Most times when you see your candles inside of a holder, if they're not, you know, they don't blend with the room. But I like how this looks. It's really cute. So, strawberry pound cake. What do you need help, help with? Let I me see. Help. If you're new to my channel, I'm auntie, the best aunt in the world. Got Flamingo Beach. Oh, look at the top on this. That's cute too. Girls are suckers for packaging. Look at that. Let's see. That, ooh. Some of these are actually Dominique's and some are boom. Since I'm the one vlogging, I mean, I'm showing them all to y'all right now. I hope they remember which ones they picked. That's gonna be the problem. Is I remember getting this one for the restroom. It's doing exactly what I wanted it to do for the restroom. Frozen Lake. Like, I like a bathroom to smell. Not like fruit or anything. Hey. Like crispy and clean. Help me! Let me see. Here we go. Yay! Oh no! It messed up again. Let me see. Sit it down. Sit it down. You getting a little bossy, Mr. Link? Oh no! Okay. Help it. me! Oh, it's not staying. Why isn't it staying? Look at this. When you clap them together like this, hey. they're not gonna stay really tight. These aren't my Help nephew's me, toys. Please. These me and Dominique Nerf gun things. <laughs> Yeah, they're in his toy box, so he be messing with them. What? And then the last one is Wild, Wild Poppy. Poppy. I think this one's Bones, if I remember correctly. Yeah, that smell like Bones. Total for five was 70 bucks, because each one was $11.60. Like I said, they had the $10 off, and then I still had the 20% off. So they bumped everything down. Everything comes nice and secure. And all of the tops are super cute. Get my camera, it's broken. It's broken? Yeah, I gotta get it fixed. I don't know if I show you all the plan or not. Still have to get a name for her. I don't know what's in this vlog, gonna say I haven't edited yet. <laughs> yeah, my phone. Who you wanna call? I'll take a picture. You wanna oh. take a picture? Yeah, hey, yeah, it's the I know y'all thinking my phone, oh, but my other phone is in the other room. I was just using it. Never mind. Edit that out. Yeah, you take a picture? Yeah, here. Okay. Thank you. Oh, he's recording. Oh, wow. Bye, tell them bye bye. Bye bye. You gotta look at the camera and say it. Bye bye. <laughs> That'll do. And that's just how I'm living. Money and freedom with Betty's bras in the seat. That's all I'm here. That's just how I'm living. Money and pretty women. Honey, some bitches.